You'd never know it, but 100 metres beneath your feet in Geneva, there are thousands of scientists trying to uncover the mysteries of the universe. So what better place for a physics trip? So we woke up bright and early back in March. I took about 40 teenagers to see what all the fuss is about. Our first afternoon had amazing weather, which allowed us to explore the city. And our first stop was the Science Museum, which I'd thoroughly recommend. Had some great artefacts in there and time for a quick group photo. Then for free time to explore the rest of Geneva and spend lots of money on chocolate. Day two is where we visited CERN, the home of the Large Hadron Collider, where protons are smashed together at 99.999% the speed of light to recreate the conditions similar to the Big Bang. First, we headed inside to see the new Science Gateway set of museums and exhibitions which are brand new this year. You can make your own star, uh, interactive displays on how the Higgs boson was discovered, an actual piece or pieces of the Large Hadron Collider, and my favourite, the biggest cloud chamber that you've ever seen that show up normally in visible cosmic rays. Next for the tour, we did get to see, first of all, the data centre, which is more interesting than it sounds, and it showed us how the trillions and trillions and trillions of bytes of data get stored, and you can even buy some in the shop. Next, we got taken to the antimatter factory, where they produce antimatter to use in experiments. It's the most expensive substance known to man. One gram of it is apparently $62 trillion. So back outside for a quick group photo. And then before heading home on our final day, we got to the, see the Red Cross Museum, which I'd really recommend. It's very harrowing in places, but a really, really good experience. And I think the students all enjoyed it. And that's about it for our Geneva trip. If you have any questions at all, put them in the comments below.